What's up, everybody? Welcome back to the channel. I'm Evil Rabbit here on the Torque Drift Beta on my iOS iPhone X. So we're here today because I have finally built car close to a pro status. It's not a full pro status yet, so we're going to check that out today. Hit the track, get some tandems, and see if we can't take a W. As you can see, I do have an MX-5 now, 558 horsepower. We are rocking import coilovers, pro wheels import coilover kit or import angle kit we are waiting on our pro calipers which will be here soon we are rocking some import tires uh let's go back into the garage because i we do have a couple more engine upgrades on this car that we do have a pro exhaust pro ecu pro clutch uh we are still rocking the import turbo because i have not made fifty thousand to get a pro turbo kit but we are running a 2J swap in this car with a full wide body kit. I wonder, can we buy a pro wide, a pro body kit yet? Or is that like 50 grand? I'm not sure how much a pro, uh, oh, 66 grand. And that's not a pro, that's an import. So we are going to take this car out into the game. We have steering lock 58, nine and a half camber. 0.5 tow, negative 0.5 tow, six caster on that angle kit. We are rocking 0.11 strength and 162 or spring length, 162k in weight in the front. I believe the rear is actually the same. And then for the pro wheels, we're rocking a bit of a track, wider track, low pressures, profile, and alloy width. So. We're gonna head to the track. I believe we got four courses we could hit up for free, and we got a 2,000 course here at the at the yard, the jump for 2,000. We're gonna hit that first. Hopefully, we can get a good jump drift with this car. I'm not sure because it is pretty low. We are rocking our Nexon A AHN or AH8 tires. We have 263 of those tires, so we're pretty good. We are rocking Grease Monkey Games, Yokohama, and OMG Drift. Looks like we're going up against the 560. Drift King Gold car. We are Drift King Gold as well, trying to get to that carbon. So let's see if we can't get a good run here on the jump section with this MX-5. Definitely been having a lot of fun here on the beta. Send ourselves into the jump. Nice on that clip. This car does handle pretty well. Hopefully we don't bang into the wall. Off the gas, spitting fire and into the wall. This is the first car I've had that is uh, spitting flames. So we did tag the wall. Hopefully... Uh, we can pick up points here in the latter part of the course. We are in the wrong gear. They definitely need to get manual gears up in this game so that we could upshift because that definitely, uh, you have to go straight to upshift gear. Kind of uh, makes a problem if you crash. So we had a very horrible lead run. We're gonna try and get a better lead run next run. Hopefully he probably got a way better run on than us. Not too much higher. He must have crashed in the wall too. So hopefully we can get a good chase. Maybe we win on the chase. But definitely been having a lot of fun on this with getting a car closer to pro status now. Still have not won a uh, a pro car from a crate yet. And uh, I've had a lot of crates because uh, we do get crates through Grease Monkey sponsorship as well as we do have some sponsorships that give us coins so I fell back way on that transition didn't car did not want to transition how I wanted it to but I do oh that's what he did so I do love this MX-5 so now he must have crashed more because we are gaining points for waiting for lead I don't think it's gonna be enough to uh, beat him overall so we're probably gonna try and get him going one more time on this track as I feel like I could do way better on this track if I uh, slowed down before that one part. Um, yeah, he beat me by a little bit, not by much. If I got better on the lead, I would have taken that. So let's see if we can be able to actually retry against him. So if you guys are still enjoying this beta, if you have the beta, let me know down in the comment section down below. If you guys are still enjoying this beta content video, let me know down in the comment section down below. Definitely got a lot of new subscribers when I started doing this beta video. So it will be bringing more beta content to you guys. I am in Chicago, so I do apologize for lack of video yesterday. Um, I had to travel to Chicago. I'm in Chicago for training. And now we're gonna go against this BRZ. Hmm. And he's on next in SU1s. So I am in Chicago for training, but I do have a lot of video content coming out this week. 
because I made sure to uh, get some recordings and stuff done before I left. Took my laptop with me and doing editing while I'm in the hotel room in Chicago. Jump drift right there, perfect on that. Hopefully we can uh, slow ourselves down, which we did slow ourselves down that time. Disconnect this way, tap the wall or tap it and keep it going, but we are in third gear and we are way off those points. Let's throw ourselves back in there, see if we can't salvage this run a little bit, try and get some points on there. That's a pretty bad run as well. <laughs> This guy's probably got a way better run than us, so we're having a little trouble here at the jump section. Yeah, yeah, by double. Because of the transition aspect and the slowing of down. So, I'm going to cut my losses, maybe try and get a good a door, door dive and get that uh, turn 14 sponsorship because I am one 100 meter door dive away. Haven't been able to find somebody that runs a really good lead run to door dive or a track that allows me to door dive very well, so... And having a little bit of trouble transitioning behind him right now. It's probably just me because this track is uh, not one of my best tracks in the game so far. But that's not a bad chase until we tag the wall. I would have been able to uh, save that loop tandem door. So we're going to head to the next track, which I believe we have like the reticle 9 or reverse reticle 9, which I'm pretty decent at. He's definitely going to beat me because he had a very solid chase as well. I lost by a lot. Kudos to that man, GG, on that BRZ. He uh, definitely has a very well set up car. Still rocking up in uh, level though, not losing too much. We are pretty high up in the gold tier, so we're not going to drop ourselves out of gold. I would like to get to carbon, but I've only seen one carbon, and he's running Dean Carney's Vipers. So we do have reticle 9, long line, and hill climb. So we're going to hop to the reticle 9, try and get some doors here and see if we can't take a W here in the beta. Definitely excited for this game to come out. The devs have been doing a lot of work, I know, on the Android platform because the iOS is pretty stable. So big thank you to the game devs here from Grease Monkey Games allowing me to bring you guys content. This guy, this if I could find out if you are in watching these videos and you are the owner of this car, let me know because uh, you throw down some dang good lead runs. And... Uh, I've fought this car a few times and I'm uh, definitely uh, it's definitely a fight when I try to go against him to try and take a W. Transition in, try and get all these clips, not smack myself into that wall like I always do. I think we missed that one clip, slow ourselves down with a handbrake, there we go. Keep ourselves in angle, keep ourselves tack, getting these clipping points. We're gonna be a little bit off those I think. We'll get one. So a little bit off course in that last section and out. Don't tell me we're gonna lose because I just smacked the pole. Please tell me we didn't just get, oh, oh my God. We just DQ'd ourselves. <laughs> we did not go across the line. Get wrecked. Ah. Uh, he probably would have definitely beat us though because of the fact of uh, that lead run he had and I missed a couple of the clips. Wait, but I still got, I lost, but I still got points? I mean, okay. I'm not gonna lie. I'm not gonna, you know, argue that. So we're gonna try and do this again. We'll probably get the same guy, if maybe not. Maybe the blue BRZ, because he seems to follow me around. I don't know if it's actually um, bot runs or if it's that, because I feel like my uh, online things are broken at the moment. I'm scared to uninstall and reinstall the game to possibly not be able to play it again because I want to keep playing this game because it's a lot of fun. So we are going to try and get a better lead run here without losing all of our clips. We break there to keep on the clips and to uh, keep on that one. And we are off those. So hopefully we can try and get these last ones. That was a pretty... Uh, shaky line so we gotta come up with something so we're gonna run this wide and try to get some close call points and then tag these two but we did lose our chain so once again a pretty bad lead run here in this car but I'm still working on this car so it doesn't handle as quite well but he must have wrecked 
he must have hit the wall or something in his lead because he goes from 87 to a 30. So he must have. So I'm going to have to keep eyes on this and uh, make sure I don't smack into the back of him when he, you know, stuffs it into the wall somewhere. Either that or he's just way offline. Initiate in. Not to hit him on transition. Oh, he was just way offline, it looks like. So I wish I could keep angle and keep these points going for the door dive, but kind of a little bit low on torque when it comes to that section. Now we're in second gear, so yeah, he was just a bit offline. So GG to him. I feel like we're going to take the win on this one, and then we're going to go to another track because I'll leave this track on a win. I feel like we probably took that win, hopefully. I feel like we did. Yeah, we took that win. Take a look at the replay. So it down, nice little door dive there. Really hard on the handbrake not to hit him. And then tried to transition back with him and uh, try and get on his door. He was just a little bit offline, so I wish I was getting points on a lot of that, but I was not. I did pass his front wheel a little bit, then had to flick myself back and transition like that as well. But overall, a good run. We did take a win on that. So we're going to go to the next track. Which I believe is the long line, which I do like the long line. I've had some decent runs in the long line. We're on two in the streak. But then there's also times where I've run uh, too deep and I smack into the barriers. And then I think we'll finish it off with the hill climb. Have a hard time in the hill climb keeping my power up because the car is not super powerful. It was only 558. Um, so it's hard to link the entire hill climb in this car unless my setup is just wrong Maybe I should need to run less grippy tires or more grippy tires. I'm not sure maybe I need grippy tires to hook up speed gonna be messing with that here soon. So oh boy Well Mad Mike with that pro car uh, It's gonna be hard to uh, take the win against a pro car unless he totally botches his run so we're going to initiate in, we're gonna get those points, get those clipping points, and break this one. We're going to miss that one, but we're going to be able to keep ourselves from smacking ourselves into that wall. Try and keep ourselves from smacking that wall. Tag that last clip, and we are off track, but we still got the points. 50,000 run. Could have done a lot better. It's a little bit offline, but I'm curious. We're probably going to 100 and some point run being a pro car. 158. We might be able to get him on the chase. As we don't run into any frame rate issue lag. We might be able to get him on the chase. Really, that guy is trying to dig himself a hole out of his cage. Jeez, oh man, buddy. My rabbit behind me trying to dig himself out of a hole. He likes to be quiet until I start recording, and then he starts to, uh, get loud so he was nice he's on his door transition with him part of the handbrake we're a little bit off his line and he made a mistake and my game just decided to uh make myself a turn straight into the wall i don't know why <laughs> sometimes it does that but we're gonna try and get back in chase i feel like he definitely beat us in the chase though so we'll see what the points total is on that as our my buddy little rabbit back there decided to uh take himself to sleep now so maybe he'll be quiet we did lose it not by much so i definitely would like to try and get a rerun against him because i feel like i was a little bit off on my lead so hopefully we can get a better run but then a chance for him to get a better run so we're gonna go in the next battle try and get this one more time and then we are gonna hit up the uphill section so hopefully we get the same guy i wonder if i should run different tires we're gonna try and run the set of Nexons, the SU1s in the front and the rear. We do have a different car. It's not Mad Mike's car. Come on. Mount tire. Thank you. So we're going to try these SU1s. Probably a bad decision, but, you know, we'll see if maybe the extra grip helps us here. Because I haven't messed really with these SU1s, so I don't know if it's too grippy. And so far, so good. Ooh, they actually, the grip actually helped us being able to turn 
from actually smacking the wall and I think we hit all of our clips but a little bit wide on the last part we are at 2.2 multiplier 79 so the SU ones actually helped us turn in grip on that section where I thought I was gonna go too wide and hit the wall what did he run at he ran a 66 four. so it was this part right here that actually the SU ones helped because it will turn in and keep ourselves off the wall so the SU ones might be the choice that I might be running on this car but we'll see how it works in the chase because being super grippy if he runs a little line we may not be able to keep angle so and with the out the ability to change gears we might be lack there of power so transition with him and we are out running him trying to uh, stay angle behind him that's not bad trying to not get too far ahead of him and also get points and he's going to take that out to the wall so we're going to slow down get our waiting for lead points he cuts across I feel like we took the win on this one. I feel like our chase was probably going to be better than his. So we're going to leave this track on a win. And we'll head to the hill climb. Yeah, we took that win, 178. So we're going to take that 1,000 credits. We are getting up there in money again to buy more pro parts to get this car to a full pro status. So that was a very uh, decent win on that one. So we are going to go to the hill climb. We are going to leave these SU1s in there. Hopefully, it'll give us the grip to get up the hill without losing too much power. So, if you guys like these videos, you guys see more, make sure you tap that like button, subscribe if you were not a subscriber, tap that bell notification if you want the videos as they come out on the daily uploads. Do appreciate all the support. We are getting really close to that 1,000 subscriber mark. So, I do appreciate all you guys subscribing to the channel. And uh, see what we can do on this last run here on the hill climb. We're going to uh, see if these SU ones help. Throw an initiation. Nice on that front. Transition. Uh, we did lose our drift chain like I thought we were going to, and the power and the frame rate is kind of uh, a little bit bad, but overall, a decent 59 point 59,000 point run probably not high enough he, this guy probably got 60 or 70 I think I think I've fought him before up here oh he stepped up his game and went up to 90 so I think this is gonna be the last chase run here on this episode we'll be bringing more out if you guys want to keep seeing the beta so until, until next time you guys know you can follow me Facebook Twitch Twitter and Instagram all the found in the description box below we'll be try probably doing some more twitch feeds now instead of YouTube live so make sure you guys follow me on Twitch, EVLRabbit underscore zero seven. And uh, should be doing some live, maybe, oh, oh, some live Twitch here on the beta. So that is going to do it for our car and our run. So until next time, guys, I thank you guys for watching. I'm Evil Rabbit, And <laughs> we just lost by a lot.